Today we will be doing a boating and fishing trip in GTA 5. We will be using the new fishing boat along with a new pickup truck. We are currently here at our waterfront apartment building outside and today we will be using this brand new 2020 Ford F-350 King Ranch. This does have the 6.7 liter power stroke crew cab here in Oxford White. And here is the boat trailer. It's a 20 foot fishing boat. The brand is the Nitro 240 boat. And here is the trailer. You guys can see it's a tandem axle trailer. It's kind of tucked away here since the boat's in the water. The Boating season is already underway and we just keep it at the dock at the local marina. So let's hop in the fort and head over there and start our day of boating and fishing. Today's GTA 5 video is rated for all ages. I have loaded down the game sound just enough to be able to hear the vehicles but uh, to not hear anything else. And I do try to have all these videos uh, for any age to watch but take a look at this a new Ford 2020 Super Duty. This thing looks so cool. We'll just switch out uh, side here. I really do like the front end here on the Ford. So let's head out. The marina is I would say less than a mile down the road. I've been looking for a fishing boat here in uh, GTA 5 and this is the perfect boat so I can't wait to take it out and we do actually have fishing rods that we could put in the water as well. I have been getting a lot of requests lately to do some GTA 5 videos and I thought this would be the perfect time to do it and we could turn. This is one awesome looking truck. It's the redesign and it's a refresh as well. So that's pretty cool. And here is a marina. So it's really close by to our house, which is great. I do want to park our truck in a way where we won't get any door dings, anything like that. We paid just over uh, $60,000 here after all the discounts and everything for this truck. And I really like it though. Awesome, so I think we'll get this uh, end spot over here. I usually prefer these end spots uh, where there's kind of grass on one side. We just kind of park so close to that curb and we'll be good. If you do have any cool ideas here for GTA 5, please let me know. I do have a few more coming this week, and the homeowner series will get uh, started back up as well. I had a few problems, but I actually worked those few out, and there we go. You guys can actually see we have the window st uh, sticker still on the Super Duty here, which is pretty cool. But let's go take a look at our boat. It's actually at the uh, first dock here. Now I do like the third person view and uh, the first person view here, so I think we'll do a mixture of it. But take a look at that, guys. Here is our boat that looks so cool down here. You guys can see it's a Nitro Z20, actually. That thing looks so cool. Now we do have the trolling motor in the front end, which will be great. And the fishing rods, everything's already on board the cooler. We'll walk over here, we'll get it turned on, and uh, we'll get it untied. And we are ready. So you guys can see it's very nice. I really do like this marina a lot. We did have a few boats over here. And I do recommend you check out the previous videos here on the channel. Taking out uh, boats in GTA 5 and some other things as well. But we'll do some interesting cool things coming up. But let's kind of go take this boat out. Our first time with this boat. And it's a pretty cool one. Now we could have actually towed the boat. Put it on the trailer. But I couldn't really figure out how to put the boat on. And if any of you uh, know let me know. Yeah, I can see one pretty cool uh, boat. We'll get to the first verse from you. Very nice as well. We actually have working gauges and everything. We are here in a no wake zone, so we can't really go too fast. Just enough, like, uh, I believe it's like 5 miles per hour. We're allowed through the no wake. I definitely do plan to do more of these videos and many of you guys do like them and liked our previous ones. They were pretty popular so I think we'll do quite a lot more of these but let me know down below in the comments guys what types would you guys like to see and I really do enjoy responding to you guys. Now I can't wait to turn on the motor in the front and just kind of slowly move as we fish.
like I have touched upon, these uh, GTA 5 videos, I really try for all ages to watch them because that's kind of the goal here for the channel is uh, content that is appropriate for all ages. Young kids uh, can watch these uh, videos that I do on my channel. Uh, we lower down the game sound just enough to hear but nothing else and I also do edit out any uh, bad uh, parts uh, that could happen here. But let's kind of see where we want to drop a line in. I think we'll probably go by the big uh, dog over there that's probably where we'll go and we could go along here but uh, I do not really want to go crashing into those uh, rocks over there so I think we'll cruise down here and head out here to the uh, big part of the ocean looks like we have a few people jet skiing really enjoying the summer so this is like a summer boating trip here and hopefully we could get some good boats and farming simulator soon this boat looks pretty cool wouldn't it be nice to have like a bass boat I believe that those are kind of the names for these some pretty big waves we are taking on so far. I think we'll probably stay like 20, 30 feet from uh, the uh, big dock over here and we'll just throw a line in. If you guys would like to see more GTA 5, leave a like and let me know down below what else should we do. They do have quite a lot of cool trucks, uh, boats, uh, sport cars, and things like that. And the homeowner series will be getting back going. I think we'll probably do it maybe every Friday, something like that, I think would be great. Now it is pretty choppy here, quite a lot of waves, and we do want to be pretty careful on how we position ourselves. But I want to catch some fish and really uh, enjoy the boat and use it for what we got for so I think we'll probably go right about here uh, seems to be good so let's kind of get off the boat here and we'll get the uh, fishing line and we'll be moving around quite a bit here but I think we'll be fine so let's come up here and we got that motor turned on and let's put the rod in and there we go you guys can see we got the rod in I put uh, I tried to throw it out as far as I can there but you guys can see you're slowly reeling it in let's see if we do have a first person view that is pretty pretty cool to have this uh fishing rod and a working fishing line you guys can see we're slowly doing it and uh, this is pretty awesome now I do have the simple native trader in to spawn everything and that's what we are using here and it looks like we have a fish here on the line we'll get it reeled in Awesome, let's uh, drop the fishing rod and pick up the fish. And there we go, guys. So we got one fish on board. Let's kind of put it over here in the cooler, but I really do like this quite a lot. Let's hop back on the boat and let's move to a new spot. So we caught one fish so far. Probably two to three fish would be great. And let's go to the other side here. The waves are getting pretty big. We will have to use quite a lot of power. And you guys can see 250 horsepower boat. I mean, that's a pretty good size engine for a boat of this size. Now, there is a good area over here that I think we should try out. It is a little bit shallower water, but I think we'll be fine. I think this boat only needs like 5 feet of clearance underneath uh, from the ocean floor. You guys can see we do have a pretty nice uh, shirt on with some uh, swim trunks and if we do want to jump in I think uh, we'll have to wait because I don't want the boat to kind of float away even if we anchor it I don't really want to run the rest there it's pretty choppy as well there looks to be a few people there on the beach with the uh, beach umbrellas and beach chairs and really enjoying the summer months I think over here near these rocks I think we'll have a good area and then I think once we throw the line in once or twice we'll call it a day after that oh yeah it's not as uh, choppy and wave so I think we'll probably go uh, let's kinda see so I think this is a good area right here don't wanna go too far in we should be able to cast a line in there as well so let's come over here and let's get the fishing line out once again awesome so we got it out there and we'll keep fishing 
this is pretty cool in my opinion being able to have a nice boat like this great fishing rod we do have the trolling motor and we are actually sliding you guys since it looks like we are moving back a little but that's okay and someone jet skiing going right by that's a bit too close and uh, I don't think they caught our fishing line And we caught another fish. So that's two fish here for us here today, which is pretty awesome. I hope you guys enjoyed today's boating and fishing trip here in GTA 5. We got to use the 2020 Power Stroke along with this new Nitro Z20 boat. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for the next one and subscribe for more.